Hello everyone, this is Moshe, the Electric Israeli. Thank you for joining. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. If you have not subscribed yet, please do. Appreciate that. Support my channel. Thank you for everything you do. I appreciate it. Uh, today I'm going to talk about one of the coolest, awesomest, uh, very practical features of all electric car, and that is regenerative braking, aka regen, as we say in the, the EV lingo. Uh, so regen basically just like in a hybrid car when you go down the hill or when you press the brakes the um, battery gets recharged just like a if you know a dynamo on, on a bicycle that spins and give you lights if you want to do a front light or something like that so that's what regenerative braking is which means the car can gain uh, a battery the fr the heat from the friction returns uh, energy back to the battery it recharges the battery especially when you go down a hill or you press the brakes down there and and what else it gives you it gives you uh, the advantages beside the regen uh, recharging your battery it also gives you uh the ability to do what is known to be one pedal driving not using the regular brake thus keep the brake paddle last for a really long time. I mean, I'm driving right now my Nissan Leaf. I have it over for more than three years. Uh, the brake's working fine and they will continue to work fine for many years to come. So I want to give credit to uh, Inside EV's uh, blog, which I love reading every day, and especially to Bradley uh, Berman, who tested a few uh, EVs. So I'm going to tell you his reaction. Some of the EVs that he tested, I did not. Some that he did, I did my, my, myself. So I'll give you my take. Uh, which EV is has the best region? So the first one he tested was the uh, Audi e-tron, and basically, and also the the at the same time the um, Hyundai Kona EV. And basically, he calls it a regular car. You know, when you drive a regular car, a gasoline car on the highway going 60, 70, and you let go with the gas, the car like slides, not slides, like glides and coasts, which is fine. In in um, in a, a regular, I mean, in an EV car, you will get something called a regenerative. The, the car will start basically re, uh, uh, blocking itself. Now, there's advantages, like I said before, and there are some, you know, you, I call it getting used to. So he said that the Audi e-tron really acts like a regular uh, a, a car uh, with that much resistant and not much uh, regen feel. Uh, and he, uh, one pedal driving is really out of the question, so to speak, really out of the question in that particular car. So that is almost defeat the purpose uh, of, the, of the EV uh, driving. Some people like it, but that's what it is. The next one, uh, oh, by the way, one more thing I want to share with the Hyundai uh, Kona is that you have a lot of pedals on, uh, uh, on the wheel. So there's a lot of cars like that, uh, like the um, Mitsubishi Highlander plug-in hybrid. They have like those pedals that you can actually choose your region. You go to level one, two, three, four, five, I believe. So that's like, it's like, I would call it a hassle. The next one was the um, Model 3 which I own, uh, and I can tell you the Model 3 is very, very aggressive, uh, very strong uh, region. You lift your foot off the pedal and it, whoo, it just takes you right back, almost to a complete stop. So a one pedal driving is, I would say, 98% possible. It will, now why 98? Because it will not come to a full stop. Okay, you, it will slow down significantly, but will not come to a full stop. But the good, the good thing about the Model Three is that you have two options, the uh, what we call standard, which is very aggressive, and low, which will really give you a little bit of regen uh, with the glide, S similar to my Nissan Leaf that I'm driving right now. Very little regen, you don't feel the aggressiveness. Like I said, you feel something, but it's not that aggressive. The next one, my favorite, the Chevy Bolt EV, very, very aggressive. That is really a true, one pedal driving really try drove it and you have an option to put the gear on low and then uh and then uh you have the uh little pedal on the left side of the wheel and that is truly a one pedal driving it's extraordinarily aggressive very similar to the um bmw i3 
also very aggressive regen. It really takes a lot to get used to it. I can tell you what I do with my Tesla, especially when I drive on highways, I put it on um, adaptive cruise control or autopilot, whatever, and then you have no worries in terms of the uh, of region i mean obviously your foot is off the table of the table of the pedal and basically it it runs itself and it blocks itself and then you don't feel it that way uh, last but not least he tested the 2018 nissan leaf uh which i drove also a friend of mine has it and the nissan leaf had something called the e-pedal but in its kind of one pedal drive but you will have to use your uh your brake pad is not a, is not as as pronounced i will call it uh much better than the first model first generation nissan leaf which i'm driving right now that has very little uh region if you put it on a b mode uh, uh, other than the d mode so i would say if i have to crown the best and again the best it, it depends on you if you like that kind of stuff i love it i love region you see the miles go up uh, i would say the bolt ev is the best the absolute best uh in terms of one pedal driving one pedal driving truly in a d mode in a d gear and in um using the uh the, the that little paddle on the left side of your wheel you will truly have will come to a complete stop it's terrific really terrific so that's that guys if you own a different um, uh ev that you like to share it would be great i can tell you that the chevy bolt the region is eh, you can put it in d and you do have the the uh the pedal on the side but the vault you know in really in low speeds not much else you know not a little bit better than the nissan leaf but not not, not by much uh, I leave it at that okay so that's that guys thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel help me change the world one electric car at a time and support this channel by becoming a patron and or shop at the electric israeli store and i see you tomorrow with another video